From the 11th to the 17th of May 2024, the armed forces of the Russian Federation carried out 28 group strikes by high-precision weapons and unmanned aerial vehicles, which hit command posts, military airfield infrastructure facilities, air defense equipment, fuel bases of the armed forces of Ukraine, as well as a production and storage workshop for uncrewed surface vehicles and strike unmanned aerial vehicles. Moreover, the strikes also hit deployment areas of nationalist groups and foreign mercenaries. Over the past week, the units of the Sever Group of Forces have liberated 12 settlements in Kharkov region, namely Borisovka, Bugrovatka, Gatishche, Glubokoye, Krasnoye, Lukyansi, Morohovets, Ogurtsovo, Oleynikovo, Pletinovka, Pilnaya, Strelecha, and continue advancing to the depths of the enemy's defense. The Russian troops have launched strikes at manpower and hardware of the five brigades of the armed forces of Ukraine, four territorial defense brigades, and the 15th Ukrainian border detachment near Veselye, Volchansk, Dergachi, Neskuchnoye, Krasnoye, and Lipci in Kharkov region. 21 counter-attacks launched by the Ukrainian assault groups were repelled close to Glubokoye, Tikhoye, and Staritsa in Kharkov region. The Ukrainian losses amounted to up to 1,175 Ukrainian troops, 10 tanks, 14 armored fighting vehicles, 45 motor vehicles, 13 MLRS combat vehicles, including 6 Checkmate Vampire MLRS, 26 field artillery guns, as well as 5 Book and Strela 10 SAM combat vehicles. The Zapad group of forces continues to occupy more advantageous lines and has inflicted fire damage on 18 brigades close to Artemovka and Makeevka in Lugansk People's Republic, Kislovka, Sinkovka in Kharkov region, Yampolo Krasny Liman and Torskoye in Donetsk People's Republic. 37 counter-attacks launched by assault groups of eight Ukrainian brigades, as well as two National Guard brigades were repelled close to Chervona Adibrova, Novoyegorovka, Stelmachovka, Nevskoye in Lugansk People's Republic, Berestavoye, Kislovka and Olshana in Kharkov region. The Ukrainian losses amount to up to 960 Ukrainian troops, two tanks, nine armored fighting vehicles, 24 motor vehicles, 4 Grat and Berba MLRS combat vehicles, 25 field artillery guns, five of which were US-made. In addition, two ammunition depots were destroyed. The U group of forces continue to advance into the depths of enemy's defense. The group launched strikes at manpower and hardware of six assault, ten mechanized, and seven territorial defense brigades close to Andreevka, Antonovka, Georgievka, Grigorovka, Kleshevka, Kordumovka, Paraskovievka, and Novomikhailovka in Donetsk People's Republic. Nine Ukrainian counter-attacks were repelled near Belagurovka of Lugansk People's Republic, Razdolovka, Krasnoye, Spornoye, and Chasovyar in Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy lost up to 3,725 Ukrainian troops, eight tanks, including five German-made Leopard 2A1 tanks, 13 armored fighting vehicles, 55 motor vehicles, one Grat MLRS, 47 field artillery guns, including 22 foreign-made ones, three NOTA and Bukov of LED electronic warfare stations, two US-made A and TBQ-36 counter-battery warfare stations, and 16 field ammunition depots have been destroyed. The Center Group of Forces has liberated the settlement of Keramik in Donetsk People's Republic, improved the situation along the front line, and defeated 14 brigades of the armed forces of Ukraine and National Guard brigades near Nova Alexandrovka, Yevgenovka, Karlovka, and Rozovka in Donetsk People's Republic. The Russian armed forces repelled 59 counter-attacks launched by the enemy's assault groups close to Arkhangelskoye, Semenovka, Ocheretino, Solovyovo, Novgorodskoye, Omanskoye, Netailovo, and Verduchi in Donetsk People's Republic. The Ukrainian losses in this direction amounted to up to 2,475 Ukrainian troops, four tanks, including one US-made Abrams, 20 armored fighting vehicles, 27 motor vehicles, and one Croatian-made Rack SA-12 MLRS combat vehicle. In addition, 23 field artillery guns, including five Paladin self-propelled guns, and three US-made M777 Howitzers were hit during counter-battery warfare. The Vostok group of forces improved their tactical situation and defeated the units of three brigades of the armed forces of Ukraine and three territorial defense brigades near Oglidar.
Velika je Nova Solka, Vodenoja, Vladimirovka, of Donetsk People's Republic, Chervone and Dorozhnyanka, in the Parozhye region, two counter-attacks launched by assault groups of the Ukrainian 123rd Territorial Defense Brigade and the 21st National Guard Brigade were repelled near Staromayorskoye and Dorozhnyanoye in Donetsk People's Republic. The Ukrainian losses amount to up to 965 Ukrainian troops, one tank, nine armored fighting vehicles, 28 motor vehicles, one Grotemol RS vehicle, and two Strela 10 SAM combat vehicles. In counter battery warfare, 20 field artillery guns were hit, including four Polish made crop self propelled guns and four US made M777 howitzers. The Dnepr group of forces liberated Rabotino in the Zaporozhye region as a result of intensive actions. They have also hit manpower and hardware of two brigades of dumped forces of Ukraine, the 35th Marine Brigade, three territorial defense brigades, as well as three National Guard brigades close to Orekhov, Verbovoye, Nestyrianka, Malaya Tokmachka of the Parozhye region, Nikopol, Kapulovka of Dnepropetrovsk region, Zolotaya Balka and Ivanovka of Kherson region. The Ukrainian losses amount to up to 265 Ukrainian troops, two armored fighting vehicles, 50 15 motor vehicles, one checkmate vampire MLRS launcher, 35 field artillery guns, including 14 US made M777 howitzers, as well as one book, surface to air missile self propelled artillery system. The group's missile troops and artillery, as well as unmanned aerial vehicles, have neutralized four Mi 24 helicopters at a helipad, as well as 40 uncrewed surface ships at a storage depot over the past week. In addition, one US made Patriot anti aircraft missile system system battalion, ammunition and fuel depots, and aerial vehicles in parks of five military airfields were hit. Aviation and air defense systems have shut down six MiG-29 and one Su-27 aircraft of the Ukrainian Air Force, 31 US-made attackams and Tochka U operational tactical missiles, 31 French-made Hammer guided aerial bombs, 15 US-made Herm anti-radiation missiles, 199 Heimars, Vampire, Grad and Dolha projectiles, as well as 329 unmanned aerial vehicles. During the last 24 hours alone, 123 Ukrainian fixed-wing unmanned aerial vehicles have been shot down over the territory of the Crimea and the Black Sea coast of the Krasnodarsky Krai. The Black Sea fleet destroyed 25 Ukrainian uncrewed surface vehicles in the Black Sea waters over the past week. Over the past week, 63 Ukrainian servicemen have surrendered on the line of contact, 48 of them in the area of responsibility of the Sever Group of Forces. In total, 601 airplanes, 274 helicopters, 24,234 unmanned aerial vehicles, 522 anti-aircraft missile systems, 16,058 tanks and other armored fighting vehicles, 1,303 MLRS combat vehicles, 9,635 field artillery guns and motors, as well as 21,763 units of special military equipment have been destroyed during the special military operation.